Good afternoon. I'm Tom Wittenschlager, and this live streaming event is coming to you from Aero's Design and Manufacturing Headquarters in Round Rock, Texas. For those of you that aren't Texans, Round Rock is just north of the city of Austin. Welcome. What are we doing today? Today's event is a product reveal of Aero's first model and new platform, the model year 2023 Aero Vanish. The v Vanish is the first of three common architecture, low speed electric vehicles in the industry, referred to as LSEVs, that Aero plans on releasing in 2023. The Vanish is our reconfigurable utility platform with lots of different payload options, but one common theme, pinnacle quality with pinnacle styling. Look, all of us drive vehicles, and our vehicles tend to be a reflection of each of our unique style, our personality, our desired image, what expectations we have. We all want to get our jobs done, and we all want to get work done, and frankly, we always want to look good doing it. That's precisely what the Aero team was determined to accomplish. To introduce a premium product into a market filled with unremarkable commodities. Yay. That said, we set standards for ourselves. Our new vehicles really had to be four things. One, they had to be sustainable. Sustainable in design, in sourcing, in production, and in operation. Two, they had to be versatile. Versatile so that one aero vehicle with a plurality of payload options could replace an entire fleet of single-use vehicles. Third, they had to be reliable. So that honestly, the only common maintenance you, you have to do is to remember when you get the vehicle in your garage at night to plug it into the wall. And then you remember about once every half year just to check the brakes. That's our definition of reliability. And finally, and most importantly, these vehicles have to be beautiful. Beautiful because our vehicles are an extension of each of our unique personal and, and brand image. So you're gonna be hearing from the whole team in terms of what these vehicles represent, how this thing came to pass, and you're gonna get a peek at a very, very gorgeous piece of gear. But now, let's have a look at our work. Carolyn, Calvin, let's take a look at her. Wow. Wow. Resort doors. Bamboo workbenches on the flatbed. Bamboo sun visors. Unbelievable utility. Huge payload. And by the way, I never want to leave out the one, in, one important thing. Not to mention looks that can kill. So let's have our chief engineer tell us how he did this how we accomplished this amazing task. Luke? Thank you, Tom. The 2023 Aero Vanish is a low speed electric vehicle with a lightweight chassis, a comfortable, well apportioned cab, and adaptable payload configurations. We started with a clean sheet when we designed this vehicle prioritizing on five key attributes, weight, performance, configurability, cost, and sustainability. In terms of weight, an LSV is limited to a gross weight of 3,000 pounds. So our mission was to minimize the base vehicle weight to maximize the payload carrying capability and of course, extending the vehicle range. Performance had to be a priority as well. We wanted to ensure lots of power from a best-in-class powertrain and a sus suspension system providing superior ride and handling. Next, configurability and connectivity to ensure that the Vanish can be easily transformed to service a broad range of customer applications with unique payload configuration. Our fourth priority, cost. Well, that's always important so that the vehicle is competitive in the market but we wanted to take that further and add a wow factor to the vehicle and provide the best value for your dollar. And then we have sustainability, where we focused our innovation and designs 
on things that would limit or even eliminate the vehicle's impact on the environment. Our objective was to build a best-in-class vehicle that delights customers with an inspired design that incorporates style, performance, and quality. So now let's dig a little bit deeper into the technical aspects. The vehicle runs on battery power, and we used a lithium-ion battery pack that has become the standard in the automotive industry. The zero emissions electric powertrain has enabled us to limit or even eliminate environmental unfriendly fluids. We do use a fluid in our powertrain thermal management system, but even there we found biodegradable options. Staying on the electrification theme, we have an electrically power assisted steering or EPAS. This has no power steering fluid, again, uh, simplifying maintenance and reducing the environmental impact. And with electric power steering, it's computer controlled, so we can tune the steering as a function of the vehicle speed. We also have regenerative braking. That's how we recapture the drivetrain energy when braking to charge the battery. So let's talk about the motor now. On the board here, you can see a picture of the motor on the right side there. It's a light, small, and powerful axial flux electric motor, or should I say axial flux capacitor, and we'll head back to the future. Or in our case, we'll just say that the Vanish is the future of LSVs. This sweet little motor is quiet, but has all kinds of torque, giving uh, great performance. And now I need to talk about suspension. Also shown here is a solid rear E-axle. We have uh, custom progressive leaf springs that we designed as well as tuned dampers. It won't matter how you load up the back of this truck, it'll ride great. For the front suspension, our team of sports car enthusiasts had to use a double wishbone suspension with racing inspired coilover shocks. It just has awesome steering and handling, what can I say? One more thing, tires are important. We could have just gone to the rack and picked the next best tire, but instead we designed a custom tire. It has a unique tread pattern, softer rubber tire compound, and um, uh, lower tire pressure, and a wider footprint. Take a closer look at this tire, and you'll see the term Schlägernull, or zero impact, meaning less damage to the train transversed. Now let's hear more about the mechanical design and configurability from our lead designer, Christian. Thank you, Mark. We have to work a little bit on your German pronunciation. Schläger Null. Um, when we started designing the Vanish, our main objective was to keep the vehicle as lightweight as possible for two main reasons. A lighter vehicle has better energy efficiency, but the more exciting reason is the payload system. And what we mean with payload system is this configurable rear of the vehicle that can be swapped and adapted to all sorts of situations. What you see here is the basic flatbed with attached stake sides. We also offer ladder racks, a, uh, a van cargo box, and temperature controlled food boxes. This sort of the adaptability makes it the perfect tool for indoor ap uh, for applications as parks and recreations, co college and corporate campuses, master communities, golf courses, and marinas. We also specifically designed the Vanish to be operated indoors. When we set the overall vehicle height and width, we wanted to make sure it can fit through a double wide standard door. The doors and mirrors are removable. And the cab over design that we chose allows us to keep the wheelbase short, which in turn makes for a very compact turning radius. Plus, the Vanish produces zero emissions, which makes it the perfect vehicle for all sorts of indoor applications, like in sports stadiums, convention centers, hospitals, and airports. When we at Aero talk about sustainability, we wanted to make sure we go beyond the current standard of electrification. Our vehicle does not become obsolete just because the requirements change. Many organizations employ a number of specialized vehicles. Many of them are much larger than they really need to be. More vehicles means more storage space and higher costs for maintenance and repair. The Vanish 
which with its excellent adaptability can eventually replace a number of them, maybe even all of them. Uh, many of the components we're using on the Vanish will also be used in our future line of products. That's what we at Aero mean with sustainability. And now off to Mariah. She wants to share a few technical details about the Aero Vanish. Thank you, Christian. So the gentleman before me talked a lot about how the vehicle was made. I want to talk to you a little bit about the user experience. And with this vehicle, we have added a lot of technology you're accustomed to seeing in your everyday vehicle. However, it's groundbreaking technology in the low-speed electric vehicle industry. Features such as CarPlay and a touchscreen display with rear view, rear view camera backup and GPS routing capabilities. Also, air conditioning, because you know here in Texas, you need that. <laughs> um, but the most exciting feature that we are introducing to our products is going to build an ecosystem of connectivity. AeroSync is a web-based application that all the users and drivers, operators, fleet managers, and us here at Aero will be able to chat directly to each other, send alerts to the vehicle. Imagine this, you're out on the golf course. It looks like a nice day when you get out there. We know weather changes instantly. So you get an alert to your vehicle, letting you know that severe weather's on the way. It's time to bring that vehicle off the course, get on the car path, and get inside. Beyond that, the other thing that you're going to be able to do is chat directly with us here at Aero for any type of support you may need. We have kind of designed this vehicle with the serviceability in mind. Um, many of the components are easily accessible with removable panels. We're also using a lot of base elements on the Vanish vehicle as well as our future product lines. Uh, Cedric would like to talk to you a little bit about the aesthetics of the vehicle here. Cedric, I'll hand it over to you. Thank you, Mariah. Man, that's going to be awesome too, Mariah, what you just talked about, because our fleet managers, they are loving this. But once again, I want to talk to you. I want to first thank our partners. You guys had so much to do with getting us to this point, and we didn't want to let that go unnoticed. And also, we have out with the old legacy, in with the new. So let us sit here and look at this Vanish. And as we look at this Vanish, of course, this is one beautiful e piece of equipment. Wow, as they take down the tailgates, how simple they actually come down. I mean, very simple. You do not have to take them off, put them anywhere. You can just lay them, just one bolt, take down. Now look at this bamboo. We, we talk about the ultimate, the ultimate the bamboo is the ultimate of sustain sustainability. And as we go around to the front of this vehicle and get into the cab, the cab has so much room as we open these resort doors. Notice the way they open. We didn't cut corners. We paid attention to details. Look at these beautiful seats. Get on in there, Christian. We're going to show them how much room is actually in here. As we get in here, wow. Wow, look at this car play. Look at this dash, man. We even have enough room to actually put our, our dog in here. Man, look at the sustainability of the, the visors, the wood grain here at the dash. Uh, don't start playing with all our buttons now. There's plenty of buttons in here. You can actually hook up to a lot of different devices. As we step out, and also look up, guys. When you look up, you actually can see out. Let's look at these beautiful seats. We cannot miss these seats. These seats are gorgeous. Comfort, comfort. We didn't cut corners there either. The steering wheel, as you pan on that steering wheel, Italian. That's Italian design. Did not feel, and I can't wait for you guys to touch it and feel it. Now, please, guys, please follow us. Add us, you know, all of that. Phone a friend. Make sure you subscribe and, and pay attention to Arrow as we Finish. Look at the front of this vehicle with our lights, headlight triplets. This is one gorgeous piece of equipment. Now, Terry, it's your turn to finish this up. Well, thank you, Cedric. I'll try to match your enthusiasm. <laughs> the aero vehicles are uniquely and thoroughly American. More than 90% of the parts in the aero vanish here are made in North America and they're assembled right here in Texas. We've chosen our vendors 
as locally as possible to give us the greatest control over our quality of our products by allowing us to connect with our suppliers real time and face to face. And by keeping our supply chain short, we cut down on our shipping times and distances, which is better for the environment, while allowing us the quickest response to our customers' requirements just in time. We've leveraged an established tier one supply line from Ontario to Michigan to Indiana to Texas. We have no trans-oceanic trans shipping containers with product of uncertain quality. Just isn't happening. Tom? Jury, thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we all hope that you found this live stream event informative, maybe even just a little bit entertaining. Behind me is the Aero team. And let me tell you, this is a team that I am indescribably proud of. It's a team large enough to undertake a development of this magnitude, but not a team so large that we're not a good steward of the shareholders' investment and the shareholders' trust. There's two things we know how to do at Aero. One is how to build beautiful, functional vehicles. The second thing we know how to do is how not to waste money. The, that combination is pretty rare in today's market. This team set some expectations, both for themselves and for one another. First of all, the expectation of proper engineering. You saw that from Luke. The engineering's been brilliant. Secondly, the expectation of the very finest of materials. Sometimes the best way and the cheapest way to build a vehicle is to actually do it right the first time, and that's what we did. Secondly, we all had expectations of superlative quality. And lastly, of course, as you've seen again and again, the expectation of an unexpectedly brilliant design, style, and elegance. Personally, I give the team an A+. The Vantage is like no other vehicle in its class, and arguably no other LSEV in the world. Just to close this out, you can follow us uh, on social media and at aero.com. Anyone, any groups interested in becoming a dealer, please reach out to us at sales at aero.com. Campuses, organizations, marinas, institutions, universities that are interested in getting your unique Vanish customized to your unique brand image, same thing. Give us a shout, sales at aero.com. We'll get working for you. And to, to kind of close it out, it's important to know that we will start taking pre-orders in about three weeks. And so we're going to have a great journey together here. And, and we're, we're building things that are uncommon. They're really, really well made. And they're made the way that, that you would want to get a product that you actually want to park in your garage, which also from time to time is not so common. Hey, thanks for joining us today. We look forward to our next conversation together. And you can count on the same team on the next webcast. Thanks. <laughs>